Hello everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. As you well known, I've been in Colombia, in my country, for a few days now. And for the ones that don't know about my country, I'm gonna tell you a few facts. It is located in South America. We speak Spanish, we love to party, and we tend to have huge families just like mine. We are seven brothers and sisters. But today I wanna focus on something very important our main dance, which is salsa. I love salsa. And today I have the opportunity to be in El Mulato Cabaret, where they have the best dancers around the world. And it just happened to be one of the guys that went on tour with Jennifer Lopez for the Super Bowl. So guys, if you wanna see this amazing episode just about salsa, keep watching my video until the end. Andres Castillo, who is one of the best dancers of Quick Swing Latino and just happened to be one of the dancers for the Jennifer Lopez Super Bowl last year. Andres, ¿cómo estás? How are you? Hello, how are you? I'm good. I'm pretty good, thank you. What about you? I'm very good, but before we start talking about salsa, I'm dying to know how was your experience working with Jennifer Lopez? So the experience with J-Lo was really, really amazing. So for me, and for the rest of the guys that were, that were over there, it was really, really fun because so that was the first event really, really big around the world that we had the opportunity to be right over there. Did you guys have to rehearse a lot? Does she make oh. you work and dance? How many hours a day yes. you guys were rehearsing? So 10 hours a day, every wow. day. Really, really, really. Uh, hard. Mm -hmm. So work with Jayla is really hard because Jayla is a person that she likes all the time that everything are really great, mm -hmm. really perfect. good, perfect. So uh, the only way that we can get everything well is that you work, work, work and work. Our salsa in Cali is very fast, yes. so I want to know that. <laughs> so, the salsa was born in New York. Mm -hmm. So, the salsa is a combination of different uh, rhythms mm -hmm. and different styles like uh, mambo, mm -hmm. cha cha cha, and guaracha. Mm -hmm. So, so many rhythms that is convenient, that's create the salsa. But the Cali style is different. Not for the salsa, it's for the way to dance salsa. And the revolution and too, the it's revolution. like it goes fast. So, yes, it's a little bit fast, but the difference is the way how, how you dance salsa. Because around the world there are five different styles. So dance salsa. The Cali is one of the five. The difference than Salsa Calenia and, um, for example, Cuban or, for example, LA. Yes, so LA the difference is that the music is a little bit fast, it's acceleration, but the full words are really fast. <laughs> before 
before that mulatto was the one that kind of put a structure to those steps because everyone in Cali was dancing really, really fast and doing different like uh, movements and figures and mulatto, the maestro, which is right behind my back, you're gonna see it later, uh, he's the one that put a structure to all of that. But Andres is gonna teach me the uh, basic steps of this particular salsa. I am from Cali and I know how to dance, obviously not like you, <laughs> but I know with his movements, he's gonna make me dance. So guys, keep watching because Andres is about to teach me how to dance. Yes. <laughs> you are from Cali, you don't have any problem. I don't have, have any salsa. problem, let's see. <laughs> <laughs> Que siempre reta, que mucho piensa, que más que nadie arriba la lleva. Cada cual pa su meta. Oye. Guys, I am super, super excited. We are backstage. I love to be back backstage. Uh, but now, Andres is gonna teach me three steps about salsa caleña. So, Andres? Yes, so the first step that we're gonna do is the basic step of Cali salsa style. Okay. All right, how is this step? It's really easy. The girls start with the left leg, the right leg. Right leg. Right leg, and the next leg. Okay. Go back in five, six, seven, go. One, two, three, five, six, seven, and one, two, three, five, six, seven, one, two, three, five, six, seven, and one, two, three, five, six, seven. Okay? Okay, so that was the first step. Let's the second step is called repique. It's called repique. Okay. Very, very caleño. Yes. <laughs> Five, six, seven, go. And one, two, cha, cha, cha. Five, six, cha, cha, cha. One, two, cha, cha, cha. Five, six, cha, cha, cha. And one, two. And five, six, one more time. And one, oh. two, cha, cha, cha. And five, six, cha, cha, cha. Okay, yes, that's repeated. <laughs> repeated. Okay. And the last one is Dinos. The last one is called Dinos. The last one is called Dinos. So, five, six, seven, go. Tap, one, two, three, tap, five, six, seven, tap, one, two, three, tap, five, six, seven, tap, one, two, three, five, six, seven, one, two, three, let's go all over. One, Caleño. Okay. See? The second one, repique. Cha cha cha. Cha cha cha. Cha cha cha. Cha cha cha. And the first, Dino. And one, two, three, and five, six, seven, and one, two, and five, six, and one, two. Okay, yeah, wow. Again. I'm already sweating and I just want to ask you one last question. Yes. How how you guys go so fast? Like you have flexibility on your knees because you go like yes. this. Yes, yes, that's is a really hard work with your knees. So the idea is that you can practice every day, you do this exercise in your home, get on the floor, whatever you can, and do this. After this, try to move your knees like this. When you move your knee like this, you see? Yes. And then try to do really a little bit fast. One, two, one, two, one, two, and then. One, oh two, five, six, seven, one, two, five, six, seven, one, two, one day, one day, one day I'll be able to do like that. Okay guys, so now that I learned the three main steps, we're gonna dance and you're going to be my judge. Okay, be gentle. <laughs> Dale Andre, ahora sí. Let's go, five, five, six, seven, go. And one, two, five, six.
which opened in 2010, offered cabaret shows every single weekend. So if you guys happen to be visiting my country, especially my city, Cali, come and enjoy an amazing salsa show. So guys, this is the end of my episode. I hope you enjoy a little bit of history about salsa. Don't forget to click the notification button and subscribe to my YouTube channel. See you next time. Ciao, ciao.